but which one in the 2022 FIFA World Cup final? It's coming up next, live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Germany, and they take on Belgium. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Manuel Neuer begins in goal. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Niklas Zule at the back. Serge Gnabry starts with Leroy Zane in the wide positions. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Thomas Müller. The starting players for Belgium. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Toby Alderweireld plays with Jan Vertonghen at the back. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Yannick Carrasco on the flanks. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And so the match is underway. Oh, good looking run. He has time to play it over. And that will be a corner. Delivering it. And the corner far too close to the goalkeeper. Well, the fact of the matter is, it should never be a surprise to see Germany in a World Cup final. But equally true is the fact that so many doubted Germany ahead of this World Cup. They have been terrific, are here on merit. And now, Stuart, they have designs on lifting the trophy for a fifth time. Yeah, you're absolutely right. We weren't quite sure at the start of the tournament what we were going to get from Germany. But the manager has got the tactics right. He's picked the right players. It's a combination of experience as well. I think they've looked a really good team. And I've got every faith they will win this game today. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Well, Kevin De Bruyne, one of the complete midfield players in the modern game. Stuart, what do you expect we'll see from him this time around? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Sets up the chance. Smuggled away.
Well, he was under a bit of stress, but back to the keeper. Oh, what an opportunity! Oh, terrific save! Well, you're absolutely right. That's a top-class save. Just look how he reacts. And how about the short corner? Super block from Gundogan. And the referee has awarded a corner following that touch. But he's gone short with it. Dangerous ball. And it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it was played over. Good work from Belgium to win it back. Kevin De Bruyne. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Jamal Musiala. An incisive pass. A matter of keeping his composure. Just had to keep his concentration to the maximum, and he did. Let's see about the delivery. Still not clear. Sané. Sané. That's someone to play it to. And there it is. Living history. The opening goal. 2022 World Cup final incredible celebrations well let's see it again because the delivery is absolutely perfect hard and low just inviting someone to run onto it and from that sort of range you'd be shocked if Gnabry missed out he just keeps showing us what a top finisher he is ball is moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be Kevin De Bruyne and Belgium in a position of menace and delivered into the box a terrific defending to stop them progressing David Raum crossing opportunity Oh, really good header, really fine goalkeeping. And an opportunity here for Germany to extend their lead. <laughs> Who can they pick out? Well, no end product. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And over the touchline, throw for Belgium here. Dries Mertens. Perfect tackle. Well, Germany certainly haven't dominated the ball so far, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good... Oh, they might score here, Stewart. And up for grabs off the keeper. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. And they have possession again. Promising sequence. A deep delivery. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. 
Dendonka. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Carrasco. Very quick thinking there. Serge Gnabry. Gnabry! Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. And a goal kick will be next. And Belgium moving the ball with purpose. Dendonker. And the cross not quite accurate enough. And it's gone behind for the corner. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Trossard. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Now, can Belgium take advantage of this set piece? <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. Still an opportunity. Well, no damage done. Perfect challenge. Mertens. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Put in by De Bruyne, not messing around with that clearance. The first half here comes to an end. And the match is underway. So, underway once more, Germany with the lead, but this game far from being done and dusted. And a timely intervention. Oh, what an opportunity! Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive! Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. Goal! So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. Müller. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Dendonka. De Bruyne now. Lukaku. Really bright looking attack. Simply couldn't beat the first defender. Jamal Musiala. Breaking at pace. It's a good-looking ball in behind. And a fine stop. And time for the change now. Joshua Kimmich with the corner. 
Well, a bit short with the clearance. Wonderful header. Excellent goalkeeping. Well, those stats tell you what a good game this has been. We've seen a lot of good attacking play, plenty of goal mouth action, and all done at a high tempo. It's been very entertaining so far. And Belgium in a position of menace. And he might be through here. Here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Goal. And the action underway again. The onus very much on Germany to find a response now. Lukaku. Happy to take on the shot. Oh, good save. Dendonka. Well, successfully cut out. Germany in a position of menace. Body on the line. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. The cross smuggled away. So a personnel change then. Short corner taken. Lukaku might fancy it, you know. Ah, goalkeeper's ball. Not the best of crosses, really, was it? Good bit of pressing. Well, racing past his man. Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Good sir. Big chance to get them on terms. Well, the goal was at his mercy. Well, it certainly was. He has to score there. High pressing work for them here. Azar. And Belgium moving the ball with purpose. Oh, big opportunity. Oh, terrific save. Well, you're absolutely right. That's a top class save. Just look how he reacts. Taken short. The Brainet. And after the cross, a tremendous block. <laughs> Playing it in. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Well, over the top it goes. He didn't miss by an awful lot. And really closing him down. Serge Gnabry. 
Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And Gutzer in the middle. Well, they can bring it out now. De Bruyne. Lukaku. Lukaku! Well, just centimetres over the bar with that powerful shot. Ten minutes left for play. Gnabry. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. And he's certainly in the mood for his second. Well, he's certainly looking a threat. He looks so sharp today well they've decided to make a change And there's the delivery. Oh, and he didn't miss by very much. Yeah, he adjusted his body so well there. It's a great piece of skill, and it probably deserved the goal. get forward but time is very much against them here Lukaku Lukaku a really good stop at the critical stage well had that gone in there was no way back not much time left now though <laughs> trying to pick out a teammate well, couldn't get it past that first defender. Showing a lot of guile there. How about the cross? Well, he made great contact with that one, but the goalkeeper had his own ideas. And short it is. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. Giving it a try. And the keeper there to deal with it. Well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt. favoured a short one here and it's Azar's cross oh left his man behind here well let's see what they have in store for them on the break Tielemans oh he's gone for goal 
Well, we gave it the big build-up, but he didn't quite deliver on his promise. Leroy Zane. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Head over towards the back post. Well, it's actually ended up being easy meat for the keeper. Tielemans. And now the final whistle. There'll be a new name on the trophy in 2022. That's of Belgium. They won the World Cup. Well, what a performance. Not just today, but throughout the tournament. They've been great. Belgium, the world champions!